Welcome back to this playthrough for Fallout New Vegas. And as I'm sitting here in the Vicky and Vance um, casino, I had a I had a feeling or thought basically. So this um, quest here: Prim's deputy has been captured by powder gangers and Bison Steve and needs to be rescued. I've got a crazy idea. Maybe it'll work. Maybe it won't. But it's worth a shot, real quick, and that's putting on this powder game guard armor. fix this weight issue. Tell you what, let me uh, get back to the uh, casino because it's right across the street. And I will sell some stuff there. Right back in here. Yeah, we'll do that. Hey, youngster, still hanging about Prim, huh? Right now, Beagle is the closest Prim's got to any organized law but he's still stuck up in Bison Steve. First thing I'd say is get his sorry butt out of there. Well, 
I'll answer what I can. Sure do. I run the courier office out of my shop. Leastways, I did before things went to hell around here. Ask away. Let's see. Been tough around here for a good while now. Worse since them thugs kidnapped our deputy. We started with the breakout from the prison up the road. First, there was just a few thugs rolling through town, but then they got organized. Now they call themselves powder gangsters or something, and run around throwing dynamite and shooting people. A little while ago, a good chunk of them left whatever kind of organization they got up there to squeeze all the food and drink out of us they could. Ask away. That's where we are. This here little casino brought some cash and bodies into the town before them powder gangsters came in. Now, they can't rush us without eating a good bit of hot lead, but we are in a kind of box canyon. Guess this is a fitting place for that as any. I reckon that if they thought hard enough about it, they'd realize they got more bodies than we have bullets. But for now, we're safe enough in here. Ask away. It's an old hotel and casino here in town. Old Laura used to rent out rooms there, but she took off months ago. Across the way from the Vicky and Vance, the other old casino. Can't miss it. I guess I don't have anywhere better to be. Well, you can call Beagle a deputy so long as you don't harbor too high an opinion of the word. Boy was about as useful as tits on a rad scorpion. <laughs> Only qualification he ever had was to be brother to the wife of the sheriff. Still, I suppose he don't deserve what's befell him. We would have considered paying the ransom. If we'd had caps to spare. Gangers, gangsters, all sounds like trouble to me. Well, yes and no. My shop's got plenty of stock. Problem is, I ain't going into my shop until I know it's good and safe. Well. Kind of ruins that plan. <laughs> okay. Bye. All right, well, got to talk to him for a little bit, and I'll just trudge my way back across the street and throw some of this junk in a. Oh my God! Please. Oh, I guess I should point out that I found a uh, dumpster. I put a bunch of stuff in there, so that's cool.
Yeah, let's use the stem pack. Come on. other than my my pride a little bit. I'm guessing that's everybody down here in this area. Oh. Well, let me make sure we're, we're clear before I let you out, guys. I don't suppose you came here to rescue me. I'd cross my fingers, but my hands are numb. Why, yes, I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most appreciative if you'd set me free. I must say it's been the low point of my career in law enforcement. The powder gangers stole into town at night and murdered my sister and her husband, the sheriff, in bed while I was sleeping in the office. I watched them for a bit, waiting for the right moment to pounce and arrest a lot of them, taking careful notes as I watched. To my dismay, they found me while I waited in the shadows and brought me here. Indeed I do, good sir. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you as soon as I am released from captivity. Well, you look to be a trustworthy sort. Okay, I'll tell you what I know. I overheard them saying that they're on their way to Novak. If you want to follow them, I strongly suggest that you follow the road through Nipton. There are a lot of dangerous things out in the desert. You won't have me with you to protect you, as I need to stay here and keep Prim safe. It would be so very delightful if you set me free. Oh, that's just marvelous. I think I'll be making my way outside now. The air is a little close in here. Oh, why, uh, of course. I'd never let you fight my kidnappers with my help, without it. You lead the way. <laughs> Why 
would have killed all of them though, but triple time. I'm a triple. Got a camp leg here. That's okay. Go ahead and get on out of here. Yeah, I might have been a little mean with those speech checks, but there's an achievement and a uh, challenge for doing 50 of those things, so speech checks it was. Johnson app. Hey, youngster. Still hanging about Prim, huh? He looks like Freddy Krueger like that. I feel safer already. <laughs> Meanwhile, there's still more of them powder gangers out there than I care to count. What we need around here is a real sheriff. Someone who can help fight off the next attack. Yeah, bye. Hey there. was quite an adventure. We taught those convicts a thing or two, didn't we? Breaking myself out of a hostage situation, not to diminish your role in it, of course, but it was quite thrilling. Problem is, there's still no law in Prim. What are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? Ah, yes. My memory is much clearer now that I'm free from my bondage. I was uh, performing recon, gathering information on some of the powder gangers, when some great cons arrived with your friend in the suit. They were talking about some delivery they took from a courier. I assume that was you? They said they'd be heading through Nipton to Novak to meet a contact there. Hey there. Hello again. I don't suppose you've decided to help Prim find its next sheriff? Oh, no. I'm just a deputy, and I can't be a deputy without a sheriff. It's called chain of command. It should be someone brave like you, but more of a homebody. Someone who'll settle down and watch over us. I heard the powder gangers talking about someone in the prison named Myers who has some experience as a sheriff. He may be a good choice. Also, with the NCR so close by, you may be able to get them to take over the town. Not sure why they haven't helped out already. You will? That's just marvelous. I'll start thinking up questions for the interview. The sheriff that was incarcerated up at NCRCF may be a good choice. You also may be able to convince that NCR guy across the road to take the town under his wing. Although martial law doesn't sound so fun. No, I don't think you have much of a choice, buddy. Howdy. Also, I think that is another Any luck here. finding a suitable candidate for our next sheriff? Ooh. Well, a deputy isn't much good without a sheriff. Uh, 
So I figured I'd come in here and protect these good people until someone finds us a new one. Maybe next time you can bring a new sheriff back with you. Oh, you're not worthless. Hey there. Right, so, rescue him. We'll talk to the NCR guys. We've got to find a place to sleep and fill up my hemp leg. Convicts in there. I don't know why these people couldn't handle themselves. Hello. I'm Sergeant McGee of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. If you want to talk about something, speak to Lieutenant Hayes. I'm from Hub originally, but it's been a long time since I saw it. I'm on my second tour here. Most non commissioned officers are. I can't imagine that deputy of theirs is worth more than a spit. I was on lookout when he got frog marched over to Bison Steve. If I had a long rifle or the order, I would have taken out the powder gangers to save him, but I didn't. It's tough shit, I guess. Sir. Hey. Yeah? We know Prim is a great strategic point, and we aren't blind to the needs of the town, but we're barely holding our own against the powder gangers. We don't have the guns or the personnel needed to carry out our mission, much less take on defending this town as well. What we need more than anything is bodies. If we had just one more squad, we could easily install a sheriff and still handle our primary objective of protecting the interstate south of here. If you'd like to see the NCR include protection of Prim and its duties, then you'll have to get some more troops up here. Knight at Mojave Outpost may be able to help. Have you gotten us any additional support yet? Knight, he's at Mojave Outpost. Sir? Ah, so... It's gonna be, uh... Take a while to. Oh, I can sleep in their beds. That's pretty nice. Let me do that real quick. Got a uh, bounty face. Hello. Let me get to my inventory real quick. While trying to deal with inventory here, I 
talked to Johnson Nash, and apparently he's got some more uh, options, speech options. So let's see what he has to say. Now your guess is as good as mine. You might luck upon someone who's a natural-born sheriff. I heard of one fellow what got himself locked in that NCR jailhouse up I-15. And maybe that ain't the best credential, but a sheriff's a sheriff. I imagine the NCR would be able to bring some law to the town, too. But from what I've seen, they barely got the firepower to protect themselves. Finally decided to make yourself useful, huh? If you can bring the law back to Prim, we'll all be in your debt. Make myself useful? Dude, I got that stupid deputy out of there for you. Well, I guess I never thought of that. I guess he could be sheriff. If you think he could be reprogrammed for it. Goodbye. I don't think I have the uh, programming or the science to do that. But I guess it's worth a try, isn't it? Move along, please. Howdy, partner. Welcome to the Vicky and Vance Casino and Museum. Trails, partner. So I think we'll take the uh, more difficult option. Right, so let me go back to my little dumpster over here and I'm gonna put some, <laughs> dump some stuff in it. So here's the plan, I think. If you look at this uh, quest, we got two options. You go to the NCR Correctional Facility, which means you're going to have to go in there, most likely guns blazing, dealing with a bunch of powder gangers. Probably not the ideal course of action at this point in time. I mean, it's marked on the map, so we can always go back there and rescue the guy, but as far as getting a sheriff for this place, I think our best bet is to go down to the Mojave Outpost and um, see if we can get that extra group of people to come up here and um, support the people of the NCR encampment outside of town, basically. Um, so yeah, this says, we can reprogram Prim Slim to be sheriff. Actually, if I did get my level, I could do that as well. Um, that's pretty much it as far as that's concerned so those are our three options to help out the town of Prim so I'm probably going to head down to the Mojave Outpost I think that's probably the best course of action as far as this is concerned right now but I have a feeling heading down there will probably be a lot of um, things in between here and there most likely that will slow things down so we'll save that for the next video until then thank you very much for watching this one and uh, yep hope you all take care <laughs>